guys, how's it going? Okay, so I thought we would read this together. It is Pete the Cat and is called Sir Pete the Brave. See, he's dressed like a knight in shining armor and his shield says cat. It's by James Dean. So here we go, Pete the Cat, Sir Pete the Brave. It is 1.9 reading level and it is half a point. Here he is. Oh, see, he's riding on the dragon. Ooh. Pete the Cat, Sir Pete the Brave by James Dean. And I believe this is the HarperCollins edition. Me meet Sir Pete, the bravest knight in the land. He looks very brave in his armor with his choppy thing. I don't know, what would you call that? <laughs> I don't know. Sir Pete rides a horse and climbs towers. See, he's, he's rescuing Callie. Right? Damsel in distress. At dinner, Sir Pete listens to Lady Callie play the harp. Lady Callie is awesome. Can any of you play a musical instrument? Bravo, Sir Pete yells at the end of each song. He claps louder than anyone. That's how we show we really enjoyed a performance, right? We clap so that the person who performed for us knows that we liked it. And the louder we clap, the more we liked it. And if people stand up, we really, really liked it. That's what you call a standing ovation. Oh, let's keep going. One night, while Lady Callie plays beautifully, someone casts a spell. Uh-oh. That doesn't seem good. And everyone falls asleep, even Sir Pete. And he's going, like he's snoring, snoozing away. The next morning, <gasps> Lady Kelly is gone. Oh no, says Sir Pete the Brave. No, Lady Kelly, she's missing. I will find Lady Kelly and save her. Giddy up. Are kitties usually big enough to ride on horses? Sir Pete falls in a hole! <gasps> the hole is a dragon's footprint! That is a my big footprint looking hole. That's right, that's right. Follow the footprints, Sir Pete says to his horse. They go over towards what? Those mountains in the distance. This sounds like a quest. The footprints stop! Where did the dragon go? <sighs> Sir Pete looks up and sees the dragon flying across the lake with Lady Callie and her harp. See the harp? And there's Lady Callie. He's on, she's on the dragon. Does Sir Pete have a dragon to fly across the lake? Sir Pete can't fly, but he can row. Across the lake he goes. <laughs> Sir Pete sees a dragon cave. He has to go inside, but it is very dark. Dark and scary. Uh-oh. Then he hears music. He must save Lady Callie. He won't be scared. It's his cat. I think I'd still be scared. He finds a harp. <gasps> but no, Lady Callie. Uh -oh. Sir Pete will not give up. He climbs the highest hill. He looks around for Lady Callie. Where do you think she's going to be? Then he hears a loud growl. Arr! Sir Pete, he's scared. <coughs> See, he's trembling in fear. <coughs> he's so scared, he's shaking. <gasps> the hill starts to move! Was it a hill? What was it? <gasps> 
Master Pete is on the dragon's back. That is a big dragon. Woohoo! Sir Pete knows what to do. He slides down, down, down the dragon's back. Meow. Like he's surfing. The dragon sees Pete and roars. Roar! Sir Pete, says Lady Kelly, I will save you. She's closer to us, so she looks bigger, right? And they're further away, so they look smaller. That's what we call perspective in art, right? Is she actually that big? And Sir Pete, that small? Save me, says Sir Pete. But I came to save you. <sighs> Sir Pete and Lady Kelly start to argue. The dragon starts to cry. <laughs> mm. Some people don't like to hear other people arguing. It can be scary. I just wanted to sing along, the dragon sobs. I did not want to hurt anyone. Ooh, sing along. That sounds fun. I have an idea, says Sir Pete. Will you give us a lift? A lift, give us a lift, is another way of saying, can you give us a ride somewhere we want to go? In, in England and in Britain, they say, give us a lift, because the car lifts you off the ground and takes you somewhere, right? We say, just give us a ride. The dragon flies Sir Pete and Lady Kelly home. Everyone is happy to see them. You don't need a great voice to make music, says Sir Pete. Just good friends. Oh, look, they even took the horse with them. Woohoo! They're going back. What friends would you seek with? The dragon joins the song. Three cheers for Lady Callie and for Sir Pete the Brave. And that is the story of Pete the Cat, Sir Pete the Brave by James Dean, the HarperCollins edition. All right, guys, talk to you later. Bye for now.